Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, Summer of Pain, week seven. We've got a Symbiote Supreme that we're gonna have to take down. Uh, in this video, we're gonna see all of the objectives done. So I've got three fights for you and a bonus fight at the end. All right, so you can see I'm gonna go in here first to get the Cosmic done, and I'm gonna choose Hercules. And I went over here just to check my inventory to see that I do have a level one revive expiring. So if I get them down really low and I don't feel like going for the solo, I'm just gonna go ahead and revive because that's gonna go bye-bye anyway. Now, I do boost up and I am running suicides. If you know me at all, you know I don't like long fights. And I don't really use these boosts anywhere else, to be honest. Um, sometimes in war, I will boost up, but uh, usually just a little 15% uh, boost. I save the really strong boosts, usually for harder content. Uh, but I haven't been doing a lot of hard content uh, recently. All right, so here are the buffs you're going to have to deal with. We double determination. Uh, you don't really want to put debuffs on him. Uh, powerful. You can't control his power, so there's no power draining. Um, that powerful from afar, you want to stay close to him because you'll degen if you're too far. You'll regen when you're close. So you want to stick close to him as much as possible. All right, so this is my very first time going in here. Uh, and with Hercules, I'm still not up on Hercules gameplay, but he is right now my most favorite fun champion to use all right so right here uh i'm doing something i really shouldn't have done i was trying to get the heavies in and you saw that i went ahead and tried to do a heavy when he had a bar of power don't do that he's gonna fire it in your face he's gonna intercept you as you saw that he did there all right now hercules there is one weakness that he's gonna have all right, so here I'm trying to bait out that special two. Uh, his weakness is when he gets that immortality, it's a buff, which means it can be staggered, all right, and nullified. All right, so here I am. I'm uh, baiting it. Now, what you saw happen there, got hit, it got nullified, down went Hercules. So that was just my first attempt, okay? So I'm looking at this and I'm just like, okay, I played that one bad from the start. Okay, that was not a good look for my boy Hercules. Definitely right now, uh, the most fun champ uh, that I have in my roster to play. All right, so here you go. Now, notice I'm doing the heavy attacks. That's how you build up his uh, feats and he does more damage. Okay, so I'm just trying to get him in that corner. All right, now that I have him in the corner, and as long as he doesn't have a bar of power, I can keep spamming that heavy. Okay, just look at that. Very nice. Now we have to back off. Okay, and we're back at it. And we can uh, evade a little bit uh, when he gets to a special. All right, now here we go. He just nullified everything. I am now immortal, and I didn't get it staggered. But look at Hercules go. Okay, you got to have Hercules awaken for this. And this is why you want him uh, to be high sig. Now, mine is not high sig yet. I don't have him at sig 200. He's actually pretty low sig. But I am unblockable, and my immortality is paused as long as I'm hitting him. So just look at this. Hercules is just wrecking him. He could fire his special three off if he wants to, but Hercules is just tearing him up. Look at this. Hercules is just insane, and I don't have him at max sig yet, but he's going there. Down goes Symbiote Supreme. That's how the fight should have gone the first time, if I had played it right. Very, very fun solo from Hercules. All right, so that is the cosmic objective done. And of course, it is my first completion, so we get the uh, point for just getting him down. All right. Now, next up, we've got, uh, and you can see um, that I just got that one completed. 
Next up, we've got the mercenary objective. Now, I don't have but like two. When I looked over my roster, I had two mercenaries ranked up. One was Luke Cage. The other one is Domino. Now, this one was actually um, the fight that took the longest. All right, you saw that the first fight with Hercules, I messed up once, got him the second time. This is my first try. The problem with Domino is that there is a bit of RNG involved with her. So I'm not gonna show you all of my attempts, uh, but this is the first one, and then um, I will show you the final one where I got uh, the solo. But uh, I want you to see uh, just how the RNG did me uh, in this fight. Now the strategy is, is really simple. You know, go in, just keep attacking, uh, bait out his specials. If he's unlucky and you're lucky, fire off your special. Um, you get to a special three, fire it off, may as well, especially when he's unlucky like that, and hope for the critical bleeds, and uh, hope that her reducing his ability accuracy will prevent you from taking a lot of the direct damage uh, that you would ordinarily take. See, right there, I took a ton of damage. Just bad, bad RNG. <clears throat> so that was the first one. That was the first one, okay? Now you can tell about how long it took if you want to calculate it. You see that I have two energy um, up at the top. Uh, just got three, okay? So I have three energy and now I have five, okay? So that should tell you how many, you know, how long it took me uh, in between, okay? Now, this one here, I had things going perfectly. You know, they were going in my favor. Uh, I didn't play necessarily perfectly. All right, there we go. He's unlucky. All right, and so I just went ahead and... Um, wait, no, I didn't, I didn't do it because I wasn't lucky. I was waiting for me to get lucky and him to be unlucky. All right, so here, I said, okay, he's unlucky. I'm at a special three. Let's do it. Hopefully, we can get some critical bleed. Now, look at my health. My health right now is top. And we just got a special three. He's got that critical bleed on him and it is chewing him up. Look at this. But now I'm worried because I don't want him to get uh, you know, a special three real quick. All right, there we go. See that power gain? Now I need to bait it out again. And I'm taking some damage because I'm far away from him. All right, but now we're back on him again and things are going pretty well. Now, worst case, we can tank as long as our health is decent we can tank one uh special three from him all right now there i was looking up and just messed up <clears throat> okay i wasn't i wasn't paying attention and got hit with the uh special three i mean a uh, special two all right but i'm just like all right come on come on we got this all right i just saw the unlucky i said let's just do it you know um maybe we'll get another critical bleed and we can get him down um, pretty quickly because I'm looking at my health and I'm like, man, uh, I don't want to do this yet again because I've done several already, okay? And now I'm pretty confident here, okay? I didn't want to hit him, all right? And I'm, I'm focused in now. I'm like, okay, we got this. No direct damage. I'm firing off a special one even. Didn't take him out. I was like, oh no, come on, let's get him, let's get him, let's get him. All right, into the block. That's okay. We got him down. All right, so uh, it's a little bit of an RNG uh, fest with uh, Domino, but keep trying it, and you should be able to get it down with Domino. As far as the mercenaries go, uh, I think she's the best uh, mercenary option. At least she's the best one that I had, all right, because um, I don't have anyone else other than Luke Cage ranked up, and uh, I don't think Luke Cage did this one uh, very well. All right, now, for the final objective, and we will have a bonus uh, fight, final objective, Dr. Voodoo for the control denial. Now, this is the first time I'm going in here with Dr. Voodoo, and I have always liked Dr. Voodoo. Dr. Voodoo is my boy. All right, so the strategy here is to build up to a special, special one, special two, doesn't matter, 
you need to have, um, I think you need to have him awaken, if I remember correctly. Um, I didn't use Dr. Voodoo unawakened. Uh, but once you get him to a special, the special of your choice, on an odd combo, like, um, uh, not there, uh, you want to, can't remember, did I do an odd combo? Yeah. You want to do an odd combo. You get Brother Daniel on him, and after that, uh, you stay. Do not fire off another special unless it's on an even, I mean, an odd combo. So that you can keep Brother Daniel on him. Brother Daniel does a lot of things, mainly reduces his ability accuracy. Similar to what uh, Domino was doing, but not RNG based. Once Brother Daniel's on there, it's getting reduced. All right, so you can stick with uh, firing off only special threes, or you can fire off special twos. Don't fire a special one, but stick to odd combos so that you can keep Brother Daniel on your opponent. And then you basically just slow play it. Now, the other little tip, and you'll see me do it here. Uh, when you parry, do a medium, light, 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 medium, and then do a full five hit combo. All right, and you'll see me do it here. So you can get in a nice, good, um, not, not, oh, let me, let me say medium, light, light, medium, then medium, light, 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 medium. Okay, so four hit combo first, ending in a medium, and then start your next combo with a medium and do the full medium, light, 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 medium. Okay. Um, yeah, don't, don't try to do two uh, full five hit, won't work. All right, and you'll see me do that in this uh, video here. All right, so let me see here. Uh, I don't want to hit him right here because I'm afraid he's gonna get, you know, special three. So I wanna bait that out. Okay, we're good. And we wanna stay as close to him as possible. Okay, so parry, okay, boom. And then you can see how many hits. That's a nine hit combo that you saw me doing there. And of course, I wanna bait this out. And that's pretty much what I do in this fight. It's a little bit of a longer fight, but if you keep that, you should be okay. All right, now I am running suicides and I think I still had uh, the boost running as well, but all that means is it'll take you a little bit longer. Uh, I've seen this fight done with a four star Dr. Voodoo. Okay, and this is a five star rank five. So you can do it uh, even with a four star if you follow this strategy, okay? Um, and one of the benefits of the nine hit combo is that you're right on him for longer, okay? And so you're gonna be regenning a lot while you're doing all of that combo, you've got the regen, you see it up there. And so you could parry or block his special two if you want to. And then follow this same strategy, do nine hit combos, and you will get that health back, okay? But you can see here, I'm still evading the special twos. I'm judging my health versus his health, and I know that I can get it down. But the way that I've played here, if you have a four star, you don't wanna do that. You, you'll, you'll die, okay? But I knew that I could do this and it would work. But you wanna be very aggressive. You wanna stay on them and um, try to do, uh, you know, the nine hit combos. Make sure you stay uh, any special with a even, I mean, a odd combo, all right? and you will be able to get him down. All right, now, uh, to close the video out, we're gonna have some bonus footage. And this last fight, and I'm gonna leave you with this last fight, um, if you have him and you are Cavalier, this is a nice, easy one shot for you. All right, so that is all of the objectives done. All right, so thank you for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And by the way, I am a complete amateur at fighting Human Torch. Uh, so if I can do it with Human Torch, so can you. All right. Uh, take care.
and you all have a blessed day.